Hello there, my name is Nick, and today I'm going to teach you how to download a YouTube video and put it onto a video enabled player MP3, uh, Zune, PSP, iPod, whatever. First, um, bring up a tabbed browser like Firefox or something, go to YouTube, and search for the clip that you want to download. Um, scroll down, find it, and click on the link. Now, once it starts um, playing, just pause it. You don't need it to play in the background. You can if you want, it doesn't matter. Go up to your address bar and um, highlight the whole thing and right click it, press copy, or um, just control C, whatever you want to do. Then type in keepvid.com. You don't need the www, it's a waste of time. Go to keepvid, then click the scroller thing here and click YouTube. You can also download Google videos and Newgrounds and anything else here um, if you want. But just a little hint, the Newgrounds videos, um, they don't download right, if at all, so just a little throw up. Um, so click YouTube, then Control V or right click paste the link into there, then press the download button. Then you'll see this little thing come up you'll have most of the time two or three. Um, if the MP4 version comes up, always download that. It's easier and much more hassle-free. Um, if not, it'll always have this .flv. Um, you can download that, um, high or low quality. I'm just going to do this for an example here. Um, so you want to bring that up, press save, and then um, put where you want to save it. Now, when you're typing in the name, put it as whatever you want. You always have to type in .flv if it's an FLV file, or it won't work. So just type in .flv and um, save it. I'm not going to save it because, of course, I've already done this. So once that's done, um, you're going to need a file converter because FLV files don't play on your computer, I guarantee you. So um, most, MV, most file converters will charge you after a while and they'll ask for a registration code and all. So a really good one would be an NCH file converter. I'll get to that. Um, the file download um, if it's a two or three minute video, will take just a couple seconds. If you're going to Google.com and downloading a full uh, episode of a show, it will take about ten minutes. So go here to nchsoftware.com and um, click on Prism Video Converter. Then just click the top button there. It's free, um, and download that. After about a month or two, it'll ask you to uh, to purchase the product and give a registration code. Um, it's really easy to fool though. Just go to your add remove programs in your control panel, take it off and then re-download it and everything will be fine. And you'll see this little icon here. It's a triangle with rainbow film. Pretty colors, yay. And that's the message you'll get. So I've had it for a little while. I've downloaded it a couple times. So bring it all the way up, then click add files and then find the file that you just downloaded and click OK. Now um, what you're going to want to do is first of all find where it's going to go so click browse and put it into the folder that you want it to go in and then after you're done doing that, now the thing is with especially iPods it'll want you to do an MP4 file so click MP4 if you're using Prism Video Converter for the first time it'll ask you to install an external component, um, just go ahead and do it. It's not very much memory. Every everything I've been doing here is very memory conservative. Um, unless you're doing like a two-hour movie, everything here will be under one gigabyte of your computer. So don't worry about any of that. And um, again, sometimes the videos, especially from YouTube, won't work. Um, if that happens, just for one thing, you can go back in and try and convert it again. Um, so yeah, then go into the folder that you just put it in, 
uh, drag it out onto your desktop. And um, I can't open iTunes at the moment because I need to do a software update. But open iTunes and then go into your library. Take that, drag it into your library, and then put your iPod in and sync it with your iPod or just drag it in. If it doesn't work, you can go back into YouTube and find an identical video because believe me I've had experience with this um ever one or two videos out of the whole search not very often won't work so just go back find an identical video and convert it cuz believe me there's always going to be an identical one and like I said before if they have the mp4 thing always download that it's a higher quality and it'll always work the FLV files if you're on YouTube don't always work so um if it doesn't have a .mp4 file and the FLV isn't working go in find an identical video and go to keep vid and see if it has a .mp4 that's basically the main idea you want to find an mp4 file because it'll always have a better file so anyways um, you can put it on a PSP or anything. Thank you for watching, and this has been Elite Speak Production.